Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker. One of the biggest threats we face today as a nation is the threat of the Chinese Communist Party at home and abroad. The fiscal year 2024 National Defense Authorization Act includes funding that protects the citizens of the United States from the imminent threat of the Chinese Communist Party. It requires the DOD to notify Congress of collaborative nuclear efforts between China and Russia and assess the cooperation between China and Iran on ICBM technology. This year's NDAA counters aggression from the Chinese Communist Party on every front. It promotes processes for our small businesses to enter the market, to work with the DOD in an effort to continue to grow the American small business economy and onshore manufacturing capacity to the United States. Additionally, the NDAA recognizes the growing threat of the Chinese Communist Party to Taiwan, reaffirming U.S. support of the defense of Taiwan to allow Taiwan to defend itself and fully funds military exercises with our allies and partners in the Pacific to counter China's growing military expansion. Further, the NDAA protects us at home by building up our cybersecurity capabilities and developing new emerging technologies in AI to help our soldiers defend against threats against our nation, and also with the largest pay raise in over 20 years of 5.2 percent barely keeping pace with inflation to help our um, uh, enlisted uh, and lower paid uh, service members. Supporting the NDAA is essential in making sure our soldiers and interests abroad are supported and defended to the highest standard while also making sure that all of us at home in the United States are protected from threats as well.